the third largest and fastest growing city in Ghana. It's in the northern region and is so worth visiting as it looks and feels so different to the other two cities, Accra and Kumasi. Guided tours come with so many benefits. Whether you are traveling alone with a partner or with a family, including children, the benefits of a guided tour include just having to show up and let somebody else do all the work. That somebody arranges the tours, arranges the hotels, the pickup, drop off etc how blissful is that the trip to Tamale included so many gems one of those was going to the Larambanga mosque which is situated in a region called Larambanga and was first built, this mosque was first built in 1421 and is the oldest existing mud brick mosque in West Africa. Absolutely breathtaking architecture and this building is currently looked after and the upkeep is car carried out by the local community in Larambanga. It's approximately a 12 hour drive from Accra and getting to know other members on the visit. Lots of beautiful people from different walks of life and different ages and we gel together really well. We ended up at Mole Park, Mole National Park in Ghana where we were able to tour the park, see lots of animals. It was well, well worth the trip. Do check out Here is Ghana Tours. They offer tours where everything is covered, accommodation, food, lots of activities, very well put together itinerary and an opportunity to meet new people and to see a part of Ghana in a very safe setting. I would highly recommend it. I had a great time in Tamale with this group. <music>